Uh, yeah, there's no question. Um, you know, talk to our guys that um, on the field right after the game that, uh, you know, you, you, you got to be able to hit the ball. You got to be able to catch it. You got to be able to throw it. But, but, but our sport is so much a mental game and mental toughness. And um, after yesterday's game and, and, and all the runs that were scored and what we gave up um, and then falling behind early, uh, it just says so much about them just from a mental toughness standpoint. And people that have been following us all year see how we battle and we nonstop battle and it doesn't matter what the score is and how we come back. So falling behind four to nothing early and then, you know, answering there's for three spot with the three spot, then getting two more on there. Um, and right after that to take the lead uh, was just, just huge. Um, and then after the long delay there, uh, bouncing back out there and, and, and Rodriguez start things off with the first pitch uh, double in Jackson with just a big two strike hit um, to, uh, to get us right back on the board and get the momentum back with us again. And uh, the, other than you said, you know, they, they put up three in the one inning, but other than that, you just give up two runs. After after yesterday, that had to be a good sign for the pitching staff to, you know, to, to shut them down on that. Yeah, and obviously once we fell behind yesterday, you know, we weren't using what you would call the quote-unquote type guys that we use to kind of finish off games and tight games. Everybody was sent out there yesterday were capable of doing better, and it was just kind of a, a weird day where, they, you know, I say hitting's contagious, and sometimes what was going on yesterday was contagious, and it was – uh, a virus that was affecting both sides of the field yeah. yesterday, but you know, uh, uh, Holyfield was incredible in relief and really did a good job. And then, you know, Lord did a great job. Those are two guys on the back end, and you know, for our guys to bounce back the way they did, and I tell them all the time, and I'm sure you know everybody on some level likes or loves their team, but I love these guys. Uh, they they play hard, they play hard all the time, and and they just want to win. And and they've done a lot of winning, but it takes that on the mental side to do what they did today, to sit through that long delay and come back out there and keep putting rounds on the board to close that thing out. And lastly, uh, Hal gets uh, four hits, a home run. Big day for him. Just talk about his play. Uh, Hal's one of our two engines at the top. You know, the two Garrett we talk about all the time. He helps run the show in the middle of the field at shortstop. We put a lot on him uh, as a player and as one of our leaders out there. Um, he does a great job of vocal leadership. He does a great job uh, as one of the best defenders in the league for sure. Um, but he hits, uh, and he hits all the time. And even when he had a little bit of stretch where he wasn't getting quite as many base hits, he was still hitting the ball hard. And we talk about it all the time, you know, that's – it's an average for a reason, but he's been a great player for us for a really long time, and uh, we're going to miss him when he's gone, but we're going to count down every second that he's here for these next few weeks. Yeah, it felt good. Um, I think the key to today was really just staying locked in the entire game. Obviously, we had that uh, that rain delay that kind of stopped things for a little bit, um, but just staying locked in and, and knowing that the pitching was going to have her back today, and obviously we're going to play good defense too. Um, just keep on swinging. Good things will happen. And uh, how big was when you came back after the after the delay there? You know, like you talk about, you get to get some big hits. Just how big was that momentum wise, just to to come back and and uh, and keep things going? Oh, that was huge. Just I, I told, I think it was Staten. Um, as soon as as soon as Jared hit that double, I knew that you know we were going to win that game. And as soon as Harris hit that ball as well, um, you kind of just feel their dugout deflate a little bit, and then the energy just kept on coming on our side, um, just deflating them.